Wow, that is one scary looking fellow. Look at that. Yeah, I am not jumping in there. Hello guys, welcome to the next episode of Astroneer with me, Biffer. Thank you for joining me. I hope you guys are all keeping well. So it's been one of the there's been an update to the game again. We've had a couple of weird things that have happened. So some of you I don't think actually, I was gonna say some of you may have noticed this. I don't think you did, but well when, when I was connecting this thing up here uh, to get all the power from that great big solar thingy up there uh, which works great as you can see these batteries fill up power floods down here but while I was making that I accidentally made um, instead of connecting these this to one of those and one of those all the way up here I accidentally made this platform and that platform but then I also connected off the side here another one of these small platforms and it goes here under the dirt as you can see and all the way up so Technically that is connected, but when that upgrades it shows as being connected, but it isn't So at the moment power isn't coming down from up here even though these batteries do fill up as you can see when you get a bit closer There we go. They pop into view. They're all filled up. The power isn't flowing down this way So what I did is I took a big truck I made a big truck and I've been taking it around and collecting all the research I can find which for some reason I put it all in a hole and it's all just been <laughs> I logged on and it's like been flipped around all over the place look look at all this research and I literally only went as far as maybe just up over that hill just over this hill just over that hill over there I did not go that far at all look there's more up there there is research everywhere and I used my big truck I'd upgraded with the massive storage thing on the back and the extra little storage things. So then I tested something out. I took that big truck. Let's come in here. Uh, because I don't have enough compounds to make a small truck. Uh, it's, you just can't find compounds anywhere. So I hooked my big truck up to this. I hooked it up to there and up to there. Like we did with the small truck as you saw at the top. And suddenly all of this power flooded through into my main base. So there needs to be a connection made here. Um, if I could get rid of these bases, I'd get rid of that one and that one and just hook there to there and it would work. I've logged on and my truck's gone. I had a great big truck. I'm glad I took the storage off, but I uh, took the research off, but the storage is all gone that I made with it and stuff like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through these research things. Um, annoyingly at the minute, we're just working off sort of the power we can get. Now the sun's come up. Let's do that. Because when this is hooked up to all that power up there, this just like instantly fills up. But this is only gaining power from this solar thing here. Okay, titanium. Let's get rid of some of the extras I've got. But what we're going to do today, I just wanted to catch you up on what's going on there. What I want to do today is head over to the radiated planet. We haven't been there yet. Um, and if we can come back with a load of compound or something, that would be really handy. Uh, let's take that beacon. Oh, I could add... Oh, we've got coal here, haven't we? I've just suddenly had a thought. If I turn one of these into... i put the resources on the side here. Um, so this could be a trade platform, but I didn't want to do that. And I think I've got the resources here for this to be made into a fuel condenser. Is that the thing I want to make? Oh, I keep saying fuel condenser, but it isn't, is it? No, it's not the fuel condenser. I want to make. It's the thing that's going to burn the coal. Winch, solar panels, storage, wind turbine, drill head, battery generator. That's what I want to make. Let's make a generator and we can burn some of this coal. So let's move that out of the way up there to give us power. There we go. We haven't done that before. So if I do that, that should keep this thing running, hopefully, and filled up with power over here. Okay, so... Let's, I'm going to go through this research, see if I get anything interesting. If I do, I'll bring you back. If not, we'll get ready to head off to the radiated planet. I think we're going to get lots of titanium. It's actually a shame that you don't sometimes randomly get. It's filling up. I'm wondering whether, if we put that over here, is that going to fill up quicker? Yeah, not so much. Power's spreading around everywhere. It's a shame you don't get some of the lower resources, like resin and compound from these as well, because sometimes you can be stuck somewhere that doesn't have, for instance, easy access to compounds, which is the problem we're having here. So, do you know what? I may even make another generator, as we do have quite a lot of coal. 
takes copper. Let's do that. Let's pop that in there. Let's make another one of these. Let's see. Can I move that over here somewhere? Yeah, that can go on there. The wind's going to be kicking in. Can I pick this thing up? That can go on there with that. There we go. Right, I'll go through as many of these as I can. I'll be back with you when we're ready to leave for the radiated planet. Look how many we've got to go through. Good grief. Oh, something else I did. Let's make sure I've got some space on my back. Oh, by the way, we've got some weird square organic. No idea what that is. And I made a nice little path going down here. So we could have driven our truck down here to collect some stuff. There we go. Can I make... I can't even make any tethers. But look, research, 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 research everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. I was hoping to be able to come down here and just find some... Whoa, there's some of those spitting things there. Just to find some easy, grabbable compound. I, oh, I thought that was a person standing there. I was thinking, what's going on? Um, I only need one more compound <laughs> to make my truck. Uh, and I just can't find any anywhere, which is a real pain. But there we go. Right, I'm still doing the research. I'll carry on. I think I've just found some. Look. Oh, I just need one compound. Yay, there's enough. Give me some compound. So I can hook up and get... Oh, we're so close. Come on, get some more power. Get some more power. Yay! I think that's all we need. We have a compound. Right, let's let's run up here, get this truck hooked up, and start being able to use all the power from up the top there. Good grief. Oh, we're going to need another chair as well. My chair has gone. Oh, I can borrow the chair from there, and then I can take the chair back. Yep, that's fine. So I'm hoping this truck doesn't disappear as well. We're just going to make a basic rover. Let's pop that on there. Hooray! Let's grab the chair. So I don't know how, why and how my big truck disappeared. I was very annoyed. I'd souped it up with all the storage you could think of. Ah, <sighs> very annoying. Okay. Could you please go on there? Thank you. Right, let's, let's actually disconnect this first. Disconnect. When you're ready. There we go. Let's drive this over here into this little hole. And when it connects to two of them, that should be okay. It's not showing it there, is it? There we go. That's fine. Let's make sure I don't get in the way. We'll connect. So watch the power come flooding down the hill. There we go. And when I do this one, should flood down the hill as well, unless everything's already filled up. But it isn't, look. That worked the other day. Why is that not... There is definitely something weird going on. Well, maybe something's got a bit balked in this update, but there is power up there. Um, and this is connected to here. This power is not being transferred through to the rest of the base. I don't know why. I don't know why. So I'm probably just going to bring a couple of these big power things down here and uh, and use those instead. Right, okay. <laughs> just a little update. I'll carry on. Right, nothing particularly amazing from that research. Lots of lithium and lots of, what's this one called, titanium. Uh, also, I had two compound here the whole time. So all of you that ran to the comments saying, Oh, MG, you're blind. I can't believe it. <laughs> I noticed. Right, so I've just sort of loaded up. Just with a load of random stuff to bring with us. Um, let's see. I've got one more slot. Anything else we could bring? Let's bring another organic because you never know. Might be needing that. Let's go and see what's on the radiated planet. I'm excited to see. Oh, just at the right time as well. Let's jump into here. Right, here we go. Let's jump out. Whoop, let's jump back in again. There we go. Saving the game. We are ready to leave. Oh, I didn't disconnect. It's disconnected for me. <laughs> no, it hasn't. It will in a minute. Yay! No, it's still connected. Let's not talk about that. I forget every time. Right, so... Let's boost up again. And let's take a look around. Oh, we're getting all sorts of weird stuff. Oh my goodness, look at the irradiated planet. There we go. Something weird going on there. Isn't it great with alpha games and updates and... <laughs> Things always get interesting. Are we coming into la Oh, here we are. Look at this. Yeah, there we go. Lots of choices. Where shall we go? 
So I'm assuming the planet's all back together now. There's no other bits of planet lying around. No, we're fine. Uh, let's just pick one. Well, let's go there. As good as any other place. Why not? So I, I have no idea. I've not been to this planet before. I don't know what it's going to be like. There we go. We're coming into land. Please don't tip over. Oh my goodness. And the weather is pretty terrible. There's power. There's Sarlacc pits. Is this going to get worse? Or is this basically how it is all the time? Let's... The first thing I'm going to do is while I've got a second... <laughs> is hopefully stop this from collapsing under here. Let's shape that out. Underneath here. Okay, I'm hoping that's going to be okay. Let's go around the other side. I don't think it's going to get stuck in the ground. We're probably going to be fine. Let's shake this out a bit here as well. Whoops. Legs caught, legs caught. Okay, that should be good. I don't think that's going anywhere. <laughs> I'm just worried this whole thing's going to tip over. There we go. I think we're good to go. So what the heck have we got going on here? Let's just put all these bits back on here. Click. Click in. Come back. There we go. I can make some tethers. It looks like there's like no resources anywhere. And what the heck's going on with this? I'm assuming I do not want to go in there. Look at that thing. Like, how close can I get? <laughs> I can get very close. And look at him. Wow, that is one scary looking fellow. Look at that. Yeah, I am not jumping in there. So what resource it? Was that the pit? It, I think it was. So uh, let's make some tethers. That's one thing we don't have any of. And explore a little bit. There's some resources around here. Okay, thanks. Tethers can't fit anywhere. Uh, let's scroll through here. There we go. That's what I'm trying to do. Uh, let's get some tethers. Let's head over this way and have a look. Oh, that didn't quite match up. There we go. And see what sort of things you've got. So what have we got over here? So we've got some copper, I'm assuming that is. Yeah. We've got copper and we've got power. Okay, that's interesting. Lots of wind going on here. What's that under there? Uh, hydrazine. No, it's aluminium. Okay, we've got aluminium as well. Well, there's no point in me collecting that because I'm not going to be able to. I'll tell you what I might do, actually. Wow, the wind! Do I have any space on here where I can leave anything? I don't think I do. i filled it all up. Oh, I've got one slot on the side here. Let's stick an organic on that. Okay. Yep, so we've got some aluminium, and that is the correct pronunciation, because I'm English. So, to all the people correcting me all the flipping time about how to say aluminium, that is the correct way. Aluminium. And we even spell it like that as well. So there. There we go. Let's stick one up there. Let's get to the top of this mountain. And hope we don't get blown off the top. And get a look at our surroundings. Oh, wow. That is... Wow, that would be a cool place for a base, wouldn't it? In the middle of there. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Not much research, not much resources. Um, it's cold over there, is there? Looks like there is. Man, these things are... Oh, stop. I wonder what's underneath these things. Let's... Oh, I can't dig out the rock that they're made of. Okay, fair enough. There's coal. That's interesting. Let's see if we can grab... Grab ourselves a coal. Yep, just about. Ouch! Let's really try not to die. So I wonder if there's many caves underground. Let's have a look. There's... I mean, I do need to find some compound if we're going to be able to carry on here. Otherwise, we're going to have major issues. Let's see. How far away can that go? Can I jump down? No! Whoa! Okay, there's nothing too dangerous yet. Oh, these are pretty spiky, aren't they? <laughs> Can I connect? There we go. Oh, no, it didn't connect. Let's connect again. Oh, it connected. Come on. Yay, there we go. Oh, 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 oh. 
Let's have a look. So we've got the little tiny ones. We've got the big ones. Let's try and sort of get rid of these. And then build over the top of them. There's more power there, which is going to be handy. Copper. It's funny how it's not saying what they are, which it normally does, doesn't it? Let's build a route back over here. Oh, don't want to get near those small ones. If I run out of tethers, I've got one more tether. And then we really need to go and find some compound, if there is any. Let's just build this up. There we go. Okay, I want you just to get through to the other side. Stop making slurpy noises. Oh, there's a big drop down there. Okay. Oh, I've got another tether. Let's... That connected here somewhere, didn't it? Let's connect that there. Ooh. Oh, wow. That light just seems to drop away. Oh, there it is down there. Look. Let's... Nope, not that one. Now, I would, at some point, like to try and get to the middle of a planet. And this planet here seems like it would be the perfect one to do it because it's not the biggest planet ever. Oh, I've got to be so careful. I do not want to fall down. Look how far down it goes. Oh, there's some of those things. Stinky things. Okay, have I got any more tethers? Oh, I do. Yep, excellent. Right, let's see if I can get down here. Okay, so I'm thinking we need to set up some sort of power source here. Wind seems to be like it's going to be a good one. So, let's maybe... Can I get this to click out over here? Or maybe this one over here. What's going on? I want to start a base. Right, I just went back and checked my video when we landed on the last planet. And I 100% clicked on this and it opened out a platform and we started building our base from that. I assumed that that wasn't a problem and that was how it was supposed to work. But maybe that was an issue, but this is not highlighting at all. No matter where I click on here, it will not send out something to start a base. So it looks like, if we want to set up a base here, that we, we need to make a habitat and bring it with us. And we're not able to just land this craft and start a base. Which is a shame, because I did want to have a look around here. How many tethers have I got left? It seems like my tethers are never ending. Uh, let's send one over there. Nope. Um... So, yeah, that is that is a bit annoying. That was my last tether. Which is a shame, because... What have we got on my back here? I don't have... Well, we could make a generator, but there's nothing... I mean, I've got some organics. There really doesn't seem to be any point. Let's just take a bit of oxygen. To sort of use our resources and... There we go. Oh, okay, this is a big storm coming in. Yeah, to use the meager resources we've got. Wow, look at that! Oh my goodness. And explore a very small distance around here. I think we actually need to bring with us a pod. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. We are going to leave. Uncouple the tethers. And we are going to go to the one other planet that we haven't been to yet. There we go. Oh, look at that. The planets are aligning. <laughs> Fantastic. So let's go up again. Here we are. So, we haven't been to... We've been to Arid. I think that's the planet we're on at the moment. We haven't been to the Tundra planet. So, all these little symbols here, by the way, all my bases on the other planets. The latest update seems to have made them stand out again. So, yeah, we're going to wait for the Tundra planet to come into focus and we're going to head off there. Oh, here we go. The tundra just came into view. I had to jump to the exotics to get a bit nearer. So let's head over to the tundra planet. Here we go. We've never seen this one before. Get a little screenshot of that. Excellent. Let's just pick a spot. Any spot will do. We've got tons of hydrazine, so pretty sure we're not going to get trapped anywhere. So I'm going to look here. I should have gone, as I jumped via the exotic, I should have made a uh, little habitat thing on the way. But there we go. We'll do another test here. Here we are. We're here. Okay, pretty windy. I'm seeing hydrazine. I'm seeing green stuff. Let's jump out and take a look. So let's test this again. Whether I can... Whoa. 
pull out a thing from here? No, I can't. I think that's been changed on one of the uh, on one of the patches. Yeah, look, can't do it. Can't do it. Can't be done. Whoa, not going to be done. Okay, let's. Well, I've got no. Um, I've got no way of getting oxygen. There's a power thing there. I could make a generator. There seems to be flowers and stuff around. Let's just go and have a quick look over here. So that is, yep, definitely hydrazine. What have we got over there? More hydrazine. Yep, lots of hydrazine. Well, that's good. That's good. I've just been reading the patch notes, actually, for the next uh, the next patch that's coming out. They are going to have removed... Oh, excellent. That's what we want. I've got space for one? Yeah. They are about to remove the thieving you can do on the trading platform. <laughs> Which is a shame. Oh, why did they bring that with me? Oh, let's get rid of the organic, because we can get tons of that, can't we? You can no longer use the trade platform and nick all the stuff off of it. That'll be... The next patch after the one that we've got at the moment. Oh, okay, that's... Yeah. Okay, let's grab those and then we'll chuck them in a hole. Like that. There we go. Nope. I want to do... That. And that. So they can all stay in there. Oh, my oxygen. 50%. Okay, let's get back. Wow. Well, this is looking like a very windy place, but a very beautiful looking place. I love all these have all these structures here so we're going to have to go and get a habitat and come back I think and set a base up here let's make some tethers uh, have we got any more space over here anywhere space on the end oh there's a generator there I didn't realise that's not going to do anything though is it it's not going to fill up the spaceship surely let's just put that on there anyway huh Apparently it's going to do... look like it's going to do something. Right. Let's make some tethers and have a quick look. There we go. I want to just go down this way and see what we can see. Uh, up over the hill. That's where I want to go. Oh, I love the colour scheme. It's fantastic. Nice flat... I mean, wind power is going to be the thing. So much hydrazine. Wow. It's just everywhere, isn't it? How far can we get? Let's let's put that one there. Let's move this one. Let's go this way. There we go. And let's hook up this one. And riding a truck around on here is going to be fantastic again. I want to get to the top of the hill. I just want to look over the hill. There we go. Is that my last tether? I can make one more. Yeah, this is going to be fantastic with the trucks. I think we're going to come and set a base up here. Definitely. If we can make... Come here. If we can find another one of those solar panel things around here somewhere, I would try and set a base up near one of those. I mean, that would just be great if we could do that. <laughs> I just keep seeing another hill and I'm like, just want to go over the hill. Just want to go over the hill. And then we can always make sure that we're set up and ready to go and dig to the centre of the barren planet in a future episode. How does that sound? Here we go. Oh, look, there we go. Is that... Oh, more height. There's hydrazine everywhere. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Right, I'll tell you what. We are going to head back to our exotic base. Or are we? Maybe we're not. I tell you what, we're going to head back to our first base because we've got tons of stuff there and you can get compound. I'm going to build a habitat and bring it back here. I think that sounds more like a plan, doesn't it? Okay, I will see you when we get back there. Here we go, coming into our Terran planet. Oh, there's the base there. Is it going to show us that quite quickly so we can get back there? Where's it gone? Where's it gone? Come on, come into focus. Oh, okay, it's around the other side of the planet. Look at that. I love the way the render's like that. Like there's been a huge planetary explosion and it's destroyed absolutely everything. Okay. Where is our base? It's here somewhere. And we're back again. Our lovely old base. There's all our rovers around. Excellent. So, let's see. What do we need to make a habitat? I don't think it should be too expensive. Let's have a look. 
wind turbines as well. So what are they taking? Aluminium. So that might be interesting to try and make some of those. So I'll tell you what, let me make some things. Let's get stocked up and then we'll be ready to head out. Right, we are ready to head back. We have the habitat. We have a lot of compound, a lot of resin, some lithium for batteries, tons of aluminium, copper, hydrazine, resin. I filled the tank right up. Yep, everything is ready to go. Can I just... See, this won't hook up now either, look. This won't hook up here, which it always used to do. So yeah, something's gone awry, but there we go. We will deal with that. I will see you back when we get to our new planet. And we're back on the planet in a slightly different location from last time because there was no base to mark down where we were, but it's looking cool. I'm liking this spot. We've got some nice rock formations. I'm not hanging over a crevasse or something with my spaceship. What have we got? Hydrazine, we've got organics. I'm looking for like a flat spot where we can start to do our base. And I'm going to see if we can set up a really nice flat base this time. I've used quite a bit of fuel getting here as well. I had to jump via some of the other planets to get here. This isn't looking too bad. I mean, maybe we could set up a base here. Do I have the ability to make some tethers to look around? Not at the moment. Well, we're at the top of the world up here looking around. So I'm going to find a spot. Next episode, we are going to set up our base on this world. Try and get some trucks going as well so we can go and explore. See what secrets there are. There is actually a cave down here. So whoa, I may set it up in the mouth of this cave if I can get rid of these spiky things down here. And then we can maybe head off down here and see what we can find. We will do that next time. Don't forget to hit the big B with the tea stain so you are subscribed to my channel. And don't miss out on any more cool Astroneer gameplay. I'm loving this game so much. And I will see you guys tomorrow for the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.